Coach Jackie with Kids Run RVA. Um, I am out here on Browns Island. It is a beautiful day, but I really wanted to show you some things that you could do with a basic towel um, outside in your backyard um, or even right in your living room or in your bedroom. All you need for this little workout is a towel, so I'm going to show you how to use this to have some fun. So first thing you're going to do is sort of roll your towel up like this and then lay it down on the ground. We're gonna do a few jumps using our towel. So the first one I want you to do is called a ski jump. So we're gonna go side to side with both feet together. We're gonna go forwards and then we're gonna see if we can actually take the ski jumps backwards. Ski jumps. And backwards. Woo! That's a little more challenging. Let's do it one more round. All right, and that's your ski jumps. Next one, your split jump. So for split jump, you're gonna be going like a scissor, back and forth. So scissor, split jump. Okay, our third jump, probably the most challenging one of all, 180 degree squat jump. So you're gonna stand on either side of the towel, feet about shoulder width apart, so not way out here and not real close to the towel, but about middle. You're going to go down, jump and twist in the air to turn 180 degrees. Jump, down, jump, down, jump, down, and that's your squat jumps. I would recommend doing about 10 of those to start. Let's see, planks with the towel. All right. So, for plank form, you're gonna go down almost like you're doing a push-up. So my hands are out, my body is nice and straight and flat, so not up here, not dipping down and hanging, but right flat. And what I'm gonna be doing is going back and forth across my towel. So out and back across. So let's do this 10 times. Okay, so that's two. Three, notice I'm counting each time across and back as one. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Last but not least, you can use your towel almost like a balance beam so you can work on your balance notice I don't know if you can tell but this is not one of my nice towels so I do not encourage you to go grab your mama's favorite towel and put it on the ground this is an old towel it's okay if it gets dirty so I'm gonna work on my balance one foot at a time lifting the other foot so you can really get a chance to learn how to balance and then take it back, which is where it always gets a little more challenging. The other thing you can do while you're balancing is take one foot, both hands up, take the other leg off the balance beam or your towel. Whoop, I'm already losing my balance, you can see. Try to get both hands down to tap your towel and then switch feet and do it on the other side. So I'm hinging forward, switching my feet, hinging forward, switching my feet, and down. So that's how you turn a basic towel into a balance beam. So there's a few other things that you could do with this towel. If you have a sibling at home or a parent that you want to do something fun with, this is not only a balance beam, it also serves as a tug of war rope. So if you were to get going with your mom or your brother or your sister, folks that are in your home that you can be close to, you get on either side, put another towel down on the bottom so you've got a line and you're trying to pull your friend across the line. All right, so that's how you would use this for tug of war. You could also use this if you've got a nice smooth surface like the linoleum in the kitchen or if you have some hardwood floors one of your friends gets some socks on so one of your siblings can put socks on they can hold on to the towel 
and your job is to pull them forward. So you're having to use your muscles to pull and drag them across the hardwood floor. There are lots of fun things that you can do with a very basic towel. So go get your towel, do some towel fitness, follow along with this video, do it a couple times every day and you'll start to feel the burn. Thanks guys.